they're yeah. having fun. They, they had are. fun, definitely. Yes. That's the Talmag trial. That reminded me a little bit of Kickstart. Do you remember Did the it? Peter Purvis programme? Yeah. Not a little really. bit like rings that. rings a bell. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. OK. I'll try and ring it a bit louder while you do the weather. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let's move on to the weather, shall we, for the rest of the week. Fairly, Alexis is here. Fairly mixed this week. A bit of snow maybe in the forecast. Ooh, uh, Colin, the yes, that. Colin Lennox Gordon took this shot of grey skies in Fiddleford in Dorset. Dulcie Levitt captured a robin in Chichester. And Dita Valerius took this shot of the cloudy weather in Ferrum. We had some heavy rain today, quite a lot of cloud as well. Some brighter spells to be had for the lucky few of us. This uh, was a scene with some brightness in Highcliffe in Dorset, captured by one of our weather watchers. Now, this week in general, we'll see some unsettled conditions. Rain at times with the chance of some wintriness in the rain and the showers. But there will be some sunshine. Wednesday's probably the better day of the week to get out and about. So overnight tonight, we're expecting a few showers following the band of rain we had today. They may turn wintry, particularly down to parts of Wiltshire and Dorset. And here over higher ground, we may see a little bit of snow, sleet, hail and some rain showers as well, where the temperatures fall towards freezing. So out in the countryside, it will be a little bit cooler. These are temperatures in towns and cities. So through the morning tomorrow, still the risk of a few wintry showers, a bit of sleet and hail mixed in there. And then... There will be some drier periods, so not everyone will have the showers. Elsewhere, we're looking at some sunny spells. It will be a breezy day and a breezy night tonight as well. Forgot to mention that along the south coast tonight, it will become very gusty. So quite a windy day tomorrow and on the inshore waters. The winds are west, five to seven, occasionally gale late, then backing southwest five or six later. The visibility is good and the sea state is moderate or rough, becoming moderate. Maybe one or two isolated showers initially tomorrow night, but they will clear and we're looking at clearing skies, so temperatures will fall away, perhaps down to freezing in some spots, so the risk of a touch of frost first thing on Wednesday morning. Now, Wednesday is the quieter day of the week. The winds will be slightly lighter than tonight and tomorrow. We'll see an area of low pressure to the north, high pressure to the south, and the winds coming in from the west, so the winds won't be as strong as recent days. And we'll see varying amounts of cloud, but some decent sunny spells. It will stay dry throughout the day on Wednesday. It's Wednesday night that the cloud will start to increase and we'll start to see rain maybe pushing in from the southwest. Now, there is uncertainty about Thursday. At the moment, we're looking at the computer models saying it's going to be a cloudy day, but the other models are disagreeing. These are models that various countries have to tell what the weather is going to be, a prediction on the weather. The prediction is on Thursday that some models are saying it's going to be raining, others are saying it's going to be just cloudy. But there is a chance we could have some rain on Friday with temperatures up to a very mild 13 Celsius and through the weekend it will be mild. Sally? That's tricky for you, isn't it? Some models say this, some mm. models say that. You're basically saying, well, it might be that, might be this. Well, this is it, <laughs> yes. Well, hedging, hedging, your, your, hedging your bets. So stay tuned to the forecast. <laughs> yeah. Yes. It's a uh, reason to watch. Yeah. <laughs> yes, absolutely. <laughs> uh, that's it from us. Uh, we're back tomorrow at half past six. And there is, of course, more news at 10.25 tonight. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night.